In the great hall of the Justice League, there are assembled the world's four greatest heroes, created from the cosmic legends of the universe. Their mission, to fight injustice, to right that which is wrong, and to serve all mankind. Hello, everybody. Thank you for coming back to Spinner Rack. We're here with the crew once again. We're going to talk about the trailer for X-Men Apocalypse. You know? <laughs> of course, naturally, some people have been downing such a great movie by uh, yes. the trailer by singing. Yes, and we have. I, I some don't, people have. I don't want to. I don't want to. <laughs> some people. I don't want to harp on it, but, you I, know. I, Mario, I'm we're gonna, here. I'm going to let the crew tell me what they think. I'm going to introduce them, and then they're going to go into their, <laughs> their minute soliloquy. Please do okay? not start with these guys before me, man. Come Once on, again, man. Once again, P-Money, here to my left. Cow to Why my right. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> I'm the D-Man. And Why D-Man. D-Man. I'm letting you hit it off. What? There we go. Don't mess up. Oh, there you go. Don't mess up. Too, Yo, too I'm late. not going to mess so, up. I don't man, give us a little something about the trailer. Explain. What do you think? Um, oh, um, as a trailer, I enjoyed it. It wasn't phenomenal. It was, didn't come across to me like Civil War where it was hitting. It didn't come to me as a Batman v Superman where, you know, we've seen something that, you know, you're waiting to see some interaction. But as a trailer for itself, just as a trailer, as an entertaining for something, after the days of future past, they, they it was entertaining. Uh, I think the reveal at the end for me that made the trailer better than it could have been or better than it was going to be for me was Professor X's bald head. When you see him boom, at the end there, oh, that's, <laughs> no, that's looking terrible. like Ironside, yeah, looking like Ironside, terrible. looking like Kojak. No, 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 no. I have to say because we were always like, uh, he was what, even when they did first class. <laughs> You were like, I know. I was like, why isn't Professor X bald? He's supposed to be bowling. Yeah, well, just, well, hey, they changed it up. Same they, same they, yeah, yeah, much. I know. Yeah, yeah. Chris Claremont, John Byrne had already, and even um, not, not even that. Stan Lee and Stan Jack, Lee yeah, and Jack yeah. Kirby. Yeah, he was a bald kid. I had no problems with that. They didn't make him bald for X Men uh, First Class. I didn't. I had. A, I, I was disappointed, but as the story progressed, I didn't have a problem with it because First Class was a good movie. Very good movie. And no, it was not. It, no, First Don't Class was good. First, first Class was, was good. Can, 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 can I finish up? Okay. Can I finish up? I, 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 no, I, I got the ball. I got the ball. I'm trying to knock this out the park. Okay. Yes. And um, <laughs> um, what you call it? Um, um, what you call it? Warren Worthington with the uh, what you call it? Um, Archangel. I'm a f- I'm fearing that. He's just going to be another side character, just like uh, what was that last third movie from the Brian, the the last movie that Brian Singer didn't do that that trilogy? What was it called? X Men United. Was it X Men no, United? No, no, Is that the, the one where stand, they were the last stand, the last stand, stand, stand. yeah, yeah. where they were curing everybody and Warren just flew out and you know out the window? And I'm thinking, yeah. I hope they don't do the same thing for because he's one of my favorite. You know, he's one of my favorite X Men mm-hmm. characters. You know, him, Cyclops. Uh, uh, um, but anyway, um, so you liked it basically as a trailer. Um, I think there's um, a lot of promise. P money, what you think, baby? Um, I don't. No, oh, here we go. Not, but then, you know, if you want to gather your thoughts, go. I can give it to somebody else. You know, you can. I'll come. I'll, I'll be ready. Oh, I'll really? Go that. ahead. Go ahead. Oh, I'm Send kind of the afraid now. I'm, you got to answer now. <laughs> you know. I think the trailer looks fun, but it's as usual not enough X Men in the beginning. What do you mean, it, not enough X-Men? It's starting off where we see all these other characters. We see Mystique walking around. We see, oh. what's the name? And she's like, oh, I got to find X-Men. And now they have this contingency. Now that because um, Magneto and Mystique are now X-Men, now when you <laughs> see them, it's like, oh, it's okay to show them. No, the real X-Men are the beasts. Yeah. Like, they always, we barely got to see the X-Men. One of the guys, I guess, is supposed to be Havoc. I'm no, Havoc sure. died. But who's the they guy? They have it in the storyline. Who's now? the Havoc other guy dead. that's there with them? Nightcrawler. That, no, not Nightcrawler, because they show the kids. That's the other thing. Who's, they start off with the dream, and they have um, they have what's a Jean Grey. Jean Grey has oh, okay. a future, a future dream. Like that's not her powers. That she's that's not true. supposed to have yeah. those powers. Who is that uh, actress? Powers of playing, playing, um, I don't Jean know who she is. That's the girl from Game of Thrones, right? I don't know. I don't I watch think Game it of is. I think it's uh, yeah, it is. That's Sansa. Sansa. The but role play Sansa in Game of Thrones. So that bit is like they keep changing power, just like Kitty Pryde in the Days of Future Past. They just want to use. Oh, okay. We, you know, she has mental powers, but we're going to use this future yeah. thing. It's like, what's going yeah. on? I'm so, not, that, to me, that, that, to, that to me, it didn't even make sense. Even the Mormon Taggart part where she's explaining, no, that's the I part was I like, like, no, I didn't like no, I, I like Mormon like Taggart, Rose, Rose but the Byrne, whole... More Burn. Yo. Burn is in there. <laughs> Burn finally yeah, made it. The name, the name. <laughs> no, no, I like I like That Rose whole Byrne explanation of, you know, he's been this guy out of, you know, through cross time, and, you know, he's been, I'm like, how do you know all of this? What, what's going on here? Well, we got to see the show so she can explain. I know. It was, just, it, it was a little bit so too P-Money, much. So, P-Money, what do you think? You, can I pass it on to... No, um, I'll just say... I'll just end up. 
I say that that's what I did like Rose Byrne in it. I'm a big Rose Byrne fan. She's so, good as Moira. So I'm Moira. Gonna, I'm going to come back to see her in this movie. You like that, huh, Petey? Yeah. You like that. Yeah, okay. Uh, yeah. uh, she won me over in uh, Get Into the Greek. Uh, oh, okay. <laughs> I know okay. why. I know why. <laughs> she didn't win you over in first class. No. 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 Wow. Okay. First class was terrible. It first was class good, was but good, terrible. Nah, it was good. It was so let me put it, it over to our man Cal because Cal has a, a short thing to say about it. Yeah, I'm just not as invested in X Men. I never really liked them, but I've enjoyed all the single films, and this looks. Par you for enjoyed the all the single films? The You're X-Men, kidding me? The X Men single films? Yeah, they were good. You, oh my! What? <laughs> you liked the first one? The second one? No. Uh, well. Yeah. The, the oh first my one is like this was it. They wow. wanted because of because wow. of the Batman movies. Terrible. People people like that one because it's like, oh, okay, you saw those terrible Batman movies. This is at least a step in the right. I didn't like it. Yeah, it was horrible, it man. In right oh, wait a second. Sorry. Do you know what <laughs> no, a frog no, no, does when it gets struck by lightning? The same well, thing that, that everything Josh else Whedon. does. Josh Whedon wrote that. Oh lord, that line, line was horrible. Okay. Yeah. And then here's the other thing. Oh, uh, we need to get <laughs> up there. Digress. Hold on a second. Di- Matt Nero was doing this. <laughs> oh, hold on a second. My powers doesn't work like that. What do you mean your powers don't work like that? You can fly, Storm. You can fly. Okay, so Brian Singer put you like that. So and then we got the black uniforms. Oh, what do you want? These things to be in yellow. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. The Josh yeah, yeah. Oh my gosh. <laughs> yeah. So my take on this is that I think the trailer is very promising. Um, just two issues that I had with it. One, the whole um, mystique not being in full color. You know, come on, it's, it's, it's I, I, I was, Gen- Jennifer Lawrence. Yeah, great. She's a big actress. Now. Right, yeah. but the problem, mystique needs to be in blue. Or, what is it? Blue, purple. They're gonna, have, they gonna have her change, but she um, needs to change. She needs. Her regular stance, or her regular she, color. She yeah, shouldn't be, yeah, you know. Yeah. Hey, that's one of the whole things. But they're selling the actress. Yeah. They're selling the actress. You think she point. actually sold the movies? I don't Come think so. On. No, Kevin no, no, no. Joy. They're going to, no. She is now a, yeah. a, a, a superstar, right? Yes. Actor. Yes. She's a superstar actor. So now they're going to push They're going to push her because this is her last one on the contract. I think this is her last movie. Listen, yeah. I like Jennifer Lawrence, but I'm saying I never thought that her job as Mystique was that great. You know what I'm trying to say? I mm-hmm. tell you the truth. No, nah, I think her, uh, no, no, her, her role, Rebecca her, Romaine, her, Romaine yes. to me was a better. Uh, yeah, uh, yes. I'm not she knocking her, but she, she was good. Put it this way Rebecca Romaine made a better mystique, but Rebecca Romaine's character it wasn't fleshed out as much as this but one this is. We're, we're not disagreeing with you. We're not, we're not, we're not, in, in, we're not opposite. We're agreeing. It's just that you're just focusing on different things. I think mm-hmm. Rebecca Romaine was a pretty good mystique. No, she made a great mystique. She made a great mystique. I look at Jennifer Lawrence and I'm like, uh, just, just not mystique. I just don't get the mystique feel off of it. Mm-hmm. Okay. Um, the second thing is apocalypse. You know, I'm just not feeling the apocalypse as much as I feel. I mean, the the trailer was good. He's okay, but I. I want to see him like doing something, turning well, people out. Well, I want to see Archangel. Well, it's a, it's a trailer. See, it's a trailer. It's a trailer. I'm just telling you, this is what But I you did see him grow. What did you see him get that large? Kind of cheesy, isn't this grow? Who's he, who's he the fighting first against? Yeah, was it Wolverine? Yeah. It's the first trailer. No, but I'm I just hoping. I want to see him. You're going to get two more. You're going to get two more. I want to see destruction. I want to see people turn from good to bad. I want to see destruction. I want to bring it all in. Because Psylocke is supposed to be in there. This saw Storm. You saw Night Storm. Crawler. Nightcrawler looked okay. Nightcrawler always looked yeah. okay, even They're from the, the first. Yeah. The, the second one, he looked. That was a great. That was a great. That Nightcrawler. was a. That so, Nightcrawler was the bomb for so the movie. Me. On, this is something we want to look at more when it comes out, right? Mm. Yeah. Okay. So, spin it right out. <laughs> <And that's it. laughs> Wait a minute. Spin it right out. 